Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, Pajis and Pajajis. Um, it's great to be here again at the uh, eighth Asian Awards, where the glitz and glamour is only surpassed by Paul Segud's outfit today. Check out his shoes. Exactly. Um, so I am deeply honoured today for to uh, to talk about this award. It truly is an outstanding achievement in cinema that this person has achieved. Um, just a few months ago, I was with her in Mumbai. I'd attended a dinner at uh, Manish Malhotra's house, and there were many other actresses there, um, Rekha, Shwarya, people like that. And she was there absolutely glowing and very, very beautiful and very composed and enjoying a, a, a resurrection, if you like, a comeback in her career. And it's staggering because before I even started my career, when I was much younger, um, she really broke enormous ground in India as being the female, the only female star who could open a movie without a male hero. And it still hasn't been surpassed, I think, today. When you saw this woman's name, people flocked to the cinema. And that's a massive achievement, even in today's world. So let's see who I'm talking about. This actress took her first steps on the road to stardom at the tender age of 14 with her first role in 1967's Kandan Karunai. She went on to star in numerous other child roles, eventually winning the Kerala State Film Award for Best Child Artist. However, it was in 1983's Sadma as Amnesiac Nehalata in which she got her big break. She followed that initial wave with cult classic Mr. India, as twin sisters in Chal Baz and in box office smash Chandni. After an acting hiatus to raise her children, she came back strong, first as an avenging matriarch in Mum, and most recently in the spectacular Thondi Muthalam Drixakshiyam, a film that was to become a bittersweet swan song. In February of this year, she tragically passed away, an event that sent the world into mourning. In final recognition of her work, she was posthumously awarded Best Actress at the National Film Awards 2018. Arguably the most famous face in Indian cinema, she is tonight awarded the Asian Award for Outstanding Achievement in Cinema. Of course, we will ensure that uh, Sri Devi's family and her loved ones will receive this. Uh, I hope they will feel the honor uh, and the love that was in this room as well. But uh, a round of applause for Shiri Devi. Thank you. you know, the, it struck me that the other reason that I think Shiri Devi was so important to us here was uh, she also arrived at that point where we were shifting from cinema to videos at home. So she was that first generation of, of, of uh, um, Indian movie stars that we had in our homes as opposed to going to the cinemas. We did both, uh, but there you go.